joy, she says. I love the view. I'm dying to know what's it really like backstage. Do you have any juicy stories? Oh, my God. Maybe, Stephanie, you might have to wait for the book. <laughs> but <laughs> what's go what goes on in the makeup room there is actually a just as good a show as what you see on the air. Maybe better because like. people are discussing what stories we should do. And, you know, Elizabeth came in this morning and she was all over me about Gloria Steinem and, and um, Jane Fonda today saying that Rush Limbaugh should be thrown off the view. And basically, I sort of agreed with Elizabeth today because I don't believe in you should stop people from talking. I believe right. in the First Amendment. So we really didn't have an argument, which... Oh, that's too bad. I know. But a lot of times we come in and we start and we'll have an argument in the room about, about politics, but it's never personal with me and uh -huh. Elizabeth. Juicy stories. Um, I don't know if I... I don't, I don't know. X-rated. I have X-rated stories. Oh, yeah. Tell us. No, you don't want to. <laughs> you can just say <laughs> dot, dot, dot. we got to have juice. Generally speaking, the bigger the star, the the... Uh, the fewer the entourage, the smaller the entourage. Oh, really? That's interesting, I think. Yeah. It's always when they're like, you'll never see them again, <laughs> that they've got 20 people with them. Who, who had the biggest entourage? Oh, I don't know. Who knows? Who remembers? <laughs> they're completely obscure. And what about who has the smallest entourage? Me. Well, so, uh, you do. You have no entourage. Yeah. And Meryl Streep has no entourage. Right. You know, and people like uh, like you guys have nobody, just one person maybe. Right, right, right. Yeah. And and uh, now you've been with a lot of a lot of hosts. How do you think that you got you survived all these changes? Medication. <laughs> <laughs> That's juicy. You can't get juicier than that, Stephanie. Well, I always feel like it's a revolving cocktail party, and mm -hmm. I'm just a member of the party, and right. people come and go. And you know, speaking of Michelangelo, you know that right. famous poem, and um, and I just kind of involve myself in the party. Right, but and you're I, but you're like one of the hostesses because you don't leave. I don't leave because I've been I stayed even when I got my other show a couple of years ago. I was able to do both. I know that's great. Yeah. You were smart enough. I to like the show. Them. It's easy for me to do it That's because wonderful. it's all off the top of my head.